everyone, Miracle Chan here. Uh, so today I'm going to do a washi tape and sticker haul. Notice I didn't say stationery because I bought a ton of uh, stationery in Japan. So uh, that'd be like five hours long. I'm just gonna try and keep this um, video short. Um, so without further ado, I'm just going to show you what I got in Japan. Let's start off with the stickers. So first of all, I love food and some of you know, so here are some food stickers. Um, so this one here um, has a lot of cakes and donuts and pancakes and there's 280 of them. And I thought these round stickers are quite cute. You can use them for journaling or you can use them um, when you're sending out letters. The next one I have here um, is uh, different types of sweets and snacks. Um, Japanese snacks uh, and you know I love snacks so I definitely had to buy this and it's a different type of sticker um, the other ones were this one's a little bit darker but you can see this one's a little bit lighter I think it's made out of um, like washi style stickers um, so yeah that's pretty interesting and let's look at the next one so these ones here um, these ones are really cute uh, and I love animals, so you'll see a lot of things that I get will have animals on them. Um, so this one's a see-through style kind of sticker. Um, and another animal sticker that I bought was this one here with penguins and polar bears. I thought that'd be super cute um, for Christmas theme journal entries. This one here um has a lot of sweets because you know i love sweets <laughs> and animals as well and it also has um some gold accent uh ac <laughs> i can't speak um but you know what i mean uh and it's really cute um this one here um is part of their kind of clothing sticker line. There were, I think, about four or five of these, but I decided to just buy one of them because this one spoke to me with all the pastels and hoodies and Ito bags. Also, I need to control how much stickers I bought. <laughs> um, this one here had a lot of cute pandas, and I went to the Yokohama Chinatown, so I felt like um, when I did a journal on this, I could put all these cute little manju on there all right and these are uh, Japanese foods and which I really love um, tempura and sushi and green tea and now for these stickers here a little bit different they're a little bit more high-end style with the gold trim um, I was really surprised to find these in Daiso because um, they're really upping their game with their stickers. Uh, so yeah, all of my favorite foods that I eat in Japan. And another one that's very similar is this one here. Um, again, lots of sushi and miso soup. Um, and they come in a pack of two, which is great because my other stickers only came in one sheet. And this is from the same line, but this one has kimonos and fans and um, traditional Japanese toys. Alright, and there's this one here. Of course, I love my Disney princesses, and I was surprised to find this at Daiso. Uh, my husband told me about this one, so I was like, oh, this is really nice, so I got this one here. And this one is the Sanrio one. This one's so pretty. Um, I love little twin stars. And I bought one for my friend, um, Sugar. Uh, I bought the My Melody version. And she probably has her present now, so it's not a spoiler. Uh, moving on, um, I have these um, flake stickers. So flake stickers are basically individual ones. And this one is food again, of course. I had curry and parfaits and pancakes and melon soda, so I thought this would be great for journaling. And I have a Tsum Tsum one. Ah, oh, so cute. 
And this is for when I journal about Disneyland or Disney Sea, which I went to both of them this year. I was lucky enough to go there. Um, these ones here are so cute. And they come in a pack of 40 with 10 different designs. It's a little bit less than the other ones, but you know, super cute. And this one here, uh, they call it flake stickers, but I kind of feel like they seem more like post-it notes, but you know, in like a cute like moment. <laughs> All right, and this one has 35 pieces. Okay, so remember that sticker that I showed you um, earlier with the animals? This one here. So I bought this one first. And then afterwards, I totally forgot that I bought this. And I bought a washi tape in the exact same style. But hey, you can never have enough animals, right? Cute animals. So <laughs> probably going to put these together. So my journal entry looks more cohesive, I guess. Um, but yeah, we're going to move on to washi tapes now. Um, so this is the washi tape I just showed you earlier. And moving on with the animal themes, I got a hedgehog one with flowers and more animals. So this one here is a animals in lattes. It's so cute. So because this one was so cute, I bought it in two different colors because why not, right? <laughs> um, navy and pink. And I drink a lot of coffee, so I really like these. Uh, moving on with more animals. So this one here has uh, bunnies and bears. And again, because I saw this in two different colors and there's, it's a super cute uh, pattern, why not buy both colors, right? <laughs> but it goes in there. Um, another animal print. So this one has... Uh, mice and snowmen. So cute. This one did come in three different colors, but I decided to stop buying them in multiple colors because my suitcase was getting really full. So, <laughs> um, so I had to stop. Um, and then this one here, I really wanted to find it in these two patterns because I saw it on Instagram. A lot of people were posting about it and probably because they kept posting about it, um, they bought all of them because I could only find this pattern, which is fine. At least I found one of them. So this one is the swan print. And it's so pretty. Reminds me of like um, Nile perch kind of style or Mackie. All right, and we're gonna move on to more food, of course. So this one here is um, a lemon print. They had it in a different color as well, but I think the navy really makes it pop. Kind of matches my lemon dress. And another one that I got here was the strawberry one, also navy. Um, it reminded me of the Lear Getter dress, which I don't have yet, but hopefully in the future I can get. And this one here, I wanted some more like um, grass themed kind of washi tape, so I got this one. Um, again, it came in four different colors, but I liked this white color the most. Okay, and then let's move on. So these ones here are sparkly washi tape. I've never seen sparkly washi tape before. Um, so this is really interesting. So this one had um, ice creams on it. And this one had um, like unicorns and cats on it. So that's really cool. I hope that they don't come off the sparkles. And more with the fantasy theme. I got this one here which has Pony is uh, unicorns actually, and um, carousels. Not carousels. What is that called again? I can't remember. My brain is not working because I just got off work. <laughs> um, yeah, that thing that Cinderella sat in. Pumpkin carriage. Ah, oh, that's what that's what it is. Um, and then I got a mermaid one here. 
this mermaid one's really pretty. It has more gold, which I noticed. Gold is very uh, popular in Japan right now when it comes to stickers and stationery. Um, and then this one here is kind of like a bubbly theme. Maybe mermaid style. Um, this one's a see-through one. I saw this uh, on someone's uh, journal entry and it looked really nice. And this one here, um, American Diner. It actually has two different washi tapes, so a thinner one and a thicker one. And it's really cute. Uh, I don't have the AP Diner dress, but I thought this dress, uh, sorry, this washi tape would be cute for a journal. And then here I have another coffee-related um, washi tape. And it even has, I believe, the... Yeah, it says cappuccino, $4.50 cents on there. And juice and everything. So yeah, I like to go out for coffee a lot, so this is great for journaling. Alright, um, and then we're going to move on to... Um, multiple washi tapes. So this one came in a pack of two. Um, oh, so all the other ones that I just showed you, they're either from Daiso, Syria, or um, Kandu. So this one is a summer themed one. And this one has um, penguins with uh, popsicles and penguins on ice cream. So this is a summer themed one and another summer themed one um, is this one with sunflowers and watermelon. I really like how this has like different sections, with different patterns on them. And then there's also some Christmas themed ones. So this was a Christmas themed one um, with gingerbread and snowman and uh, all that. All right, um, so what else do I have here? Right, we're going to move on to the bigger rolls now. So this one I also got from Daiso and it was only a dollar, well a hundred yen, um, for four. And this one I actually found in the Ikebukuro Sunshine City Daiso, which is a very small Daiso, but they had a ton of these um, multi-pack ones. I couldn't find them in any other Daiso. Um, and this is the other floral print. So I really like floral prints. These are two different types of floral print. This one's a more pastel one. And this one is more of like a darker color. Um, and then this one had multiple ones. These ones are actually really nice. So this rainbow one, um, all the primary colors, and then this pastel rainbow one, which I really like. Reminds me of the sweater that I bought from WC in Japan. And then I saw they had a few of the other ones with patterns on them. So this one has purple and blue, and this one has orange and yellow and green. So these ones are pretty nice for when you journal. And of course, I had to get some um, food washi tape. So this one here is um, different types of fruits. So we have, um, I think this is a cranberry and blueberry, avocado, and pineapple. And this one here is um, different types of um, snacks. And I really like this one. And another one here is um, one with macarons and um, drinks and tea, like chinaware. So teacups and everything like that. Oh, and we have two more of the big rolls here. So uh, this one has different types of weather. So on rainy days, I can use this one. Um, it rains a lot here. <laughs> um, and then I got this one as well. So this one has alpacas on it. So the first one's kind of like dancing alpacas. And the second one has like the alpacas with a little blurb that you can write in and alpacas with just their head. It's so cute. I actually saw alpacas for the first time in Hokkaido and they were adorable, but very, very smelly. 
All right, and so those are all the ones um, from Daiso. Um, oh, and there's one more here. So this one is a princess one. I really like this one. It's a lot thicker, this princess one, but and it was the last one actually on the shelf, so I'm really glad that I got it. So um, yeah, so on the topic of Disney princesses, I actually bought um, washi tapes from the Disney store um, and also at Disney Sea. So this is one of the ones that I bought. It came in a pack of three and it has Ariel on it. She's so pretty in her dress. Um, and then it has a thinner one with seashells and then another one with different types of decorations. So this one is um, a lot more expensive than 600 yen as opposed to 110 yen from the other ones. And um, these ones here, they look like that, but it's so pretty, I couldn't resist. And then from the same line, they have the Rapunzel one. So the Rapunzel one. And I love Rapunzel, especially the flowers in her hair. So then they made a washi tape with flowers and also teacups here this one was also 600 yen for three and that's what it looks like and another one i bought from the disney store was this one here um this is actually a very popular in japan right now it's in the form of like a washi tape roll but it's actually just stickers so you kind of peel them off and this one i saw and i was like oh my gosh i have to have this so this one has different types of princess dresses as well as the matching shoes so they have rapunzel here and alice and we have um, ariel yeah it's super pretty so this one has 10 different styles and 80 in total and this one was 400 yen um, I also went to the Disney store to get a gotcha. So gotchas are um, like in the machines and you can kind of just turn. Usually they're like 200 to 400 yen. Um, so I really, really hope for the washi tape one. Um, they had different types. And my first roll, of course, I got the washi tape. Yay. And it's the one that I actually wanted. So this one is the Rapunzel one. Um, so it's not too much in the roll. I think it was 300 yen, I believe. Um, and it actually came with stickers as well. So these are the stickers that it came with. Super cute, Pascal and Rapunzel. Um, I also got another one. So from the same line, um, this one was um, one with just stickers. Um, oof, when my, my phone focused. Um, so the one that I got was Rapunzel here and then the other one that I got was actually a box. I can't remember which one it is. Oh actually so it came in a box like this. Um and this little hole is for the key. It's really cute. So you have to put the key in there and you turn it and it opens. And it actually locks, which is pretty pretty genius. Um and then inside there's different types of stickers. So this one is the sticker in a box version. This one had different stickers in it. Um, and also came with the sticker. So this sticker, I believe, is for the book. So Aurora, which is my favorite, and Belle. So I can just stick this onto the book and then put the stickers inside as well, which is really, really neat. Japan just comes up with the most interesting things. Um, and then another gotcha washi tape that I got was from Animate and this one um, is from the manga series called uh, Junjo Romantica or Pure Romance or something like that. I can't remember what it is in English. Um, and I gave it a try and I got this washi tape. It's really cute. Not too much, but you know, it's pretty interesting. Um, and then moving on, so um, a washi tape that I got from Disney C. I only got one because I wanted to limit myself, <laughs> not buying too many. They're not, um, they're not that cheap, um, but this one was relatively cheap. 
Um, and so I got this one because I am going to journal about Disney Sea and it has most of the Disney Sea um, rides um, on here as well as the SS Columbia, which is where I went to have lunch. Um, and it was fantastic. Yeah, this one was a little bit cheaper. This was 400 yen. Some of the stickers were like 800 to 900 yen and I couldn't justify getting those, so I didn't get them. <laughs> It's kind of sad I couldn't find the Duffy ones though. Um, and then another one I had here. Oh, forgot to put this one. So this one is um, a Sanrio one. This is Little Twin Stars, which is my favorite. And uh, a random one that I actually found um, is this one from um, Baby Starshine Break. Um, it was, this is pretty rare. I found this in Closet Child actually, um, and I actually have a few AP washi tapes that are similar and I got it from AP Tea Parties, so I'm not sure if this one's from a baby tea party. Um, for any of my viewers, if you know, um, yeah, do let me know. It's so cute though. And it looks like it's in brand new condition, which is fantastic. Um, I think last but not least, uh, I have a washi tape from Pokemon Center. Um, so Pokemon Center just released their winter Christmas um, merch and so I bought the Sylveon plush um, as well and then I bought this washi tape at Tokyo Skytree. So Tokyo Skytree, um, if you're a foreigner and you show them your passport, um, they give you this kind of coupon book and because I bought something from Tokyo Skytree um, Pokemon Center, I received a free Skytree sticker, which is pretty cute. Alright, and I think that's all that I have for today. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, do let me know. Um, maybe I will post more of my other hauls and also let me know what you like the most and um, yeah, so see you guys. Bye. Thanks for watching.